After an intense four hour session tonight, Bay District schools and the local teachers union have come up with a contract. This agreement ends the negotiations, which were contentious at times, with teachers staging public protest. As News 13's Courtney Evans tells us, the district came up with about $5 million to raise the minimum teacher salaries and give everyone a raise. After months of negotiations, Bay District Schools and the Association of Bay County Educators say they have a teacher contract. After months and uh, many months. hours at the bargaining table, yes. um, we have settled on the contract. The agreement sets the district's base salary at $47,544 per year. That's up from the previous minimum of $45,615. It gives our new teachers to the, the minimum, which was a huge goal for both sides this year to be able to reach that minimum because then kind of the monkey gets off of everybody's back and it becomes much easier to talk about raises and finances going forward. The raise will cost about $5 million. The district will pay about $3.16 million of that. The state will pay the rest, about $1.845 million. An average raise of 5.52, and it's, mm -hmm. it, 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 it's across the board. Some teachers will see more than that, but an average raise of 5.52. Settling this is important for both sides. It's a milestone for us to achieve that. We think that the $47,500 salary will help us continue mm -hmm. to attract new teachers, to retain new teachers, and most importantly, Importantly, we took great steps tonight to make sure that everybody on the salary schedule is going to see a raise, including some people that were kind of caught close to that minimum mm -hmm. that might have gotten just a small raise, but the union and the district came together with language to make sure that everybody gets a significant raise. Remember, a good bargaining session is one where nobody gets everything they want and nobody loses everything they want. And I think we struck a good compromise this year. There was some language that we left on the table that we really, really liked and wanted and we'll bring back another year to fight again. And there were the things the district really wanted that they left on the table in the interest of being able to finish so that teachers know what their raise will be. It may have taken several months to sign the dotted lines, but Bay District Schools and ABCE walked away from Tuesday's meeting with a bit of relief. In Panama City, Courtney Evans, News 13, Panhandle Strong. The contract still has to be ratified by a majority of the teachers union, then approved by the school board. That's not expected to happen until January.